Hello, my name's Rook, and I'd like to welcome you to Shold, an RPG horror game made by a man named Kelvin. Let's get started. Overture. At last, I'm here. Why am I here? I don't know. Where am I? I don't know that either. But I have a feeling that I've been eagerly longing to come here. I am at the end of my journey. I carry nothing more than this book. It's completely blank, except for the final page. There are seven words. Superbia, Avaridia, Luxuria, Ira, Gula, Invidia, Asadia. The seven deadly sins, the greatest taboos that exist. What happened here? A natural disaster? The Last Judgment? In any case, it looks dead. Perhaps I could still find someone to tell me where I am. And more importantly, why I'm here. Okay then. Uh, you. Yeah. Is that a joke? Canned goods? Guess way to eat? Nope, it's all spoiled. Oh, is that a key? Rusty key obtained. Unlock the door, please. Scissors, perhaps? Pliers. Of course. Uh, the box is empty. The box contains matchboxes, and the matchboxes contain box matches. All right. Oh, all right. Right on. Whoa. Is that it is? Well, it said something about the seven deadly sins, so is this like gluttony or something? Greed? Doesn't look like it would be missed, so. $500 obtained. Leave that alone. It's not worth anything anymore. Because of inflation? No, it's just not worth anything anymore. The only thing that's worth anything is your body. What are you getting at, Mr. Stranger? I don't think I'm up for it. I don't understand what you mean. Th they're coming. They're back to hunt for body parts. Run away, you with your clean flesh. As you can see, not much remains of me. Jason. Oh, handy. File two. Well, oh, geez, button. Yeah. Dang it. Get out of here, go, go, go. Yes. All right. Pretty sure they came here before. Oh, nice. So, oh jeez. Oh, man. Let's try that again. Uh, 
Oh, geez, they got like speed boost. You can come now. What happened to you? A fire? No. What are you asking? Are you trying to make fun of us? No, excuse me, I, I wanted to... You must know about the rot. Everyone has it. But you look so healthy. No one is immune to the rot. Perhaps it just hasn't broken out with him yet. Do any of your body parts feel... numb? No, I feel the same as I always do. If this rot exists, of course it does. Just look at us. We're slowly rotting. Please calm down. Think about the operation. It's not good for you to be upset before it. Come with me now, please. Will I get a new arm? Yes, you just need to be a little patient. <laughs> They're in a hospital. She is a little patient. Wordplay. How terrible. I didn't know there was such a terrible disease. Their flesh was deep brown and hung in shreds. In some places, you could even see the bone. Just thinking about it makes my stomach turn. I feel sorry for... Do I also have this rot? That's a good question. You? A fire alarm. Don't pull that, you'll get in trouble. Oh, look at you. He was beyond saving. You said. I do not believe you. You do this to punish me. Back then, I made a bet together with a few good friends. They trusted me when we actually won something. I kept all the profit. The court gave me the right, but you did not. I I'm sure that you wanted to punish me. Um, I'm sorry, man. I didn't mean it. Oh. That's an arm. When I was in elementary school, I already started to steal. Not because I'm, I suffer from kleptomania, but I'm greedy. If there was something that I wanted, I just had to take it. This greed is a feeling stronger than hunger or thirst. Even now, after I've lost an arm, I still want to take the possessions of others. Oh, well, don't let her near your wallet, man. Locked. Oh, look at that guy. He's just a dot. Oh, he could talk. Okay. <clears throat> My whole life, I did nothing other than amass money. I lived as sparingly as possible, and if I spent money, it was just for me. No one else should get any of my money. I was the one who had earned it. But all the money in the world cannot stop this disease. The fact that it has eaten me so fast must be a punishment. Now that I have realized my mistake, I was told that it's already too late. I only have one, maybe two weeks to live. Is that not unfair? Why does Scrooge get a second chance and I do not. Oh. What's, what is this? Oh. Is it a puzzle? Did I win? Oh, I see. It's a fun puzzle. Yeah. There you go. Yeah. 
block it. That's another body part. I should really clean this place up. Oh, I need a card. I think. Oh, look at you. If you wish to be examined, you must go to the waiting room. That's the thing I need. Wait a second, wait a second. I think I just completely blew off whatever that puzzle thing was. Yeah, there's something in there. Later. Of course. So, maybe I got a... Oh, fire alarm. Maybe I could set that off. Maybe. Box. Yeah. You? Medical. Empty. Oh. Oh. Of course. The trash was ignited. The lighter is no longer needed. That's a pretty bold assumption. The trash can is on fire. What? Did you do this? No, I didn't touch it. I was gonna... <clears throat> I didn't do that. Moving on. Wait, can I go in here? I probably already checked. Nope. Nice. Oh. It's like from Lone Survivor, the mirror. A mirror? Why does it look so clean? It seems a bit out of place. What? But no one else is here. Oh, jeez, seizure. Okay. Greetings, Aaron. My name is Virgil. I am here to guide you. You want to help me? No, I can only guide you. I cannot help you. I don't understand. You will in time. Can you answer my questions? That depends on what you want to know. But in principle, yes. Well, can you tell me anything about this rot? Where did it come from? Unfortunately, I cannot answer that. But it is a disease that slowly rots the body. It is on the exterior of the body. The disease is first apparent. So it kind of sounds more like a parasite, but moving on. The internal organs are affected last. What about me? Am I also sick? I cannot tell. I am not a doctor. Maybe you should ask one. It's a good plan. I think I just lit his biz on fire, though. So, oh. Why are they all staring at me like that? Because they are greedy for your healthy flesh. Do you not see their greedy eyes? Each of them is jealous of your whole body. They want to tear off your arm and legs. How much do you want for your arm? I don't quite understand what you mean. I will not, it will not be long until I can no longer use my other arm. I want a new one. Y yours. I don't care how much it costs. I'll give you however much you want. This is absurd. I have more cigarettes than you can imagine. You'll never find such an offer elsewhere. If your arm has begun to rot, it's too late. So think quickly. You can make the deal of a lifetime. What do you say? Get lost, I'll never give my arm. I want this guy's arm. You can have all the cigarettes you want. We must go. Aaron. Otherwise, that man will kill you. Oh, jeez. Oh, man. Save file. Oh, Jesus. What is this? Sparkles? Ow, ow, ow! 
Dang it, what was that? No, don't throw knives, please. Ow! What about you with sparkles? Come on, come over here and take sparkles. Ow! Yes! What is this? A cup? Oh, nice. Come in here. Yes! Boss fight. Ow! Ow. He didn't even hit me. Come on, man. What is in this box? Ow. Okay. What? He just hit it. Money you could have. It's all yours. I like two thousand bucks. What's your problem, man? Oh. What? Did he just rot? How low have these people sunk to try to kill others out of greed? Everyone would do so, Aaron, if the circumstances required it. I cannot accept that. I would never sink so low. I don't want to. Where's the exit? I want to get up before it's too late. This door leads to the exit. What? Cigarettes? They signify power. Everything you know, whether cash, precious metals, or valuable stones, has long since lost its value. Besides flesh, cigarettes are the only valuable currency in this world. And they are the only thing that could somewhat ease the pain. Wait! Something has been bothering me. Ever since you first appeared. You come and go as we please. The others didn't seem to see you. How is this possible? Are you a ghost? Are you even real? Why are you here? Oh, Virgil said that. Why are you here? That I cannot answer. And that's my answer. Oh, thanks. So, cigarettes? So they can ease the pain? Ow. There's other stuff. Marijuanas. There you go. What? 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 Oh, let's get out of here. Oh, it's the little stub. That's adorable. That's the man from before. How awful. I didn't think the rock could progress so quickly. But why is he still smoking when he's already so sick? Even if he gets cancer, I guess he probably won't be any more worried about it. He must be worried. The cigarettes accelerate the sickness. But maybe that's what he wants. How can you want that? Do you feel sorry for him? No, just disgust. You will come to understand when the rot has broken out in you. But I will not wait that long. Whoa. What? We want you to voluntarily donate your body parts. Of course not. Who in their right mind would choose to do so? Release me at once. You cannot do this against my will. What are you, a monster? We've long since become beyond monsters. Damage the arm as little as possible. I cannot guarantee anything. Not with this wooden saw. Wooden saw? Uh, you're all crazy! Holy...
Virgil, they bumped me up. What? What more do you want? Are you angry? Of course I am. I think your arm will be a good service for the man. You're just as sick as them. That was my arm. How can you be so cold? Are you enjoying it? I'm not in a position to judge morality. But I think that man was far off, far worse off than you. It doesn't give him the right to mutilate me like this. Now what? What will happen to me? It will come back. I want to get away. I'll find a way out if you search for one. Okay then. Seems like we've got an off-colored tile. Yep. Rusty knife. Always good. Bed. Oh. Screwed in. I need a screwdriver. Oh, cool. String. I'm getting all sorts of crazy jive. What about this? So now that I have... Yeah. Box. There you go. Alright. Hook in... Oh, there's a key. Oh, well I've got a whole bunch of inventory, yes. With their powers combined? <laughs> I'm actually really surprised I figured that out so quickly. Okay. Neat. It looks worse. Apparently humans aren't the only thing affected by the rot. There must be a safe place somewhere. That's good optimism, I like it. I should check out this bunker. That's a bunker? Oh yeah, I can see that. The door only opens with a code. Above the lock is a message. When the die is cast, it does not count what we see, but rather what is opposite. Below are the numbers. Five, three, one, six, four, and two. Well, it said opposite, so. It's my guess. Perfect. Oh, it's lovely. Oh, you scared me. You're not one of them, right? No, I'm not. You live in this bunker? Yes, we have to. Here we are safe. Is that a bomb? Top right. Not only because of the hunters, we believe that the rot does not progress as quickly in houses. Why don't you give us your company? We were just about to eat. I've made a nice roast. Do you like beef? Or maybe you prefer some pie? Actually, neither. I don't like either. Can you really be so picky? In these terrible times? I know how crazy it sounds, but I hate everything greasy and sweet. Look at it as kind of a strange quirk. I have a deep fear of becoming fat. Oh, well, then sorry, we have nothing for you. Oh, man. Did someone come to visit, Mama? Yes, we have some company. Y your eyes. How awful. The rot has struck her harder than it has us. I would love to give her one of my own eyes. But I'm too much of a coward. Isn't that pathetic? We will not live long anyway. It's not so bad, Papa. I've already become used to it. But if I could have one wish... I would love to have one last glimpse at the sea. What are you doing, Aaron? We live in times in which we must share. Right.
this is truly a sight I can never forget. Are you still so worried, Maria? Can you really tell so easily? It is kind of hard to miss. I still think that we shouldn't meet here, not in my house. You worry too much. He wouldn't cancel a business trip just like that. E even if he did, he would announce it first. Aaron, what are you doing, man? Are you cheating on this poor family? Maybe one of the neighbors, we'll see. I don't want him to know about it, you know how quickly he becomes jealous. I'm not afraid of him. But, I- Knowledge.